Hello YouTube, kumusta na? So this is our last day in Mexico. So shout out again to Lindsay and to Isma for inviting us congrats! to our wedding. Congrats, congrats, babe. Ano sa tingin mo dito sa resort overall? Ang ganda niya kasi 'di ba most resorts um yung room parang bare lang, ganyan and then you wanna be encouraged to go outside. Pero ito kasi all parang lahat-lahat siya. You can stay in your room, you know, just relax, malaki siya, spacious. May jacuzzi. May jacuzzi, tapos maganda yung view or you can go out. Um, at tapos yung pala, yung room service, diba, it's all included na, so you can literally stay in your room. Or lumabas ka, ang laki ng space, ang dami, may horseback riding pa nga doon somewhere. Uh, and, or, or, tapos yun nga, parang you can, para siyang ano, para siyang all you can eat na resort na, ano, oh, <laughs> na pare. spa. So it's an, it's a great experience, it's worth the, it's worth the money. And you'll really be in a bubble. So, parang ang saya lang. Ang saya lang. Ayun. So, kung mailig kayo sa mga beach, kung mailig kayo sa mga resort type na all-inclusive, guys, you have to check it out if ever you're in Mexico. Play, Playa, Fines, Mujeres. So, yan. Check out na kami. Kunin namin yung COVID test. Alam ko naman negative. So, we should be good. We'll be heading back to San Francisco. And then, um, this vlog, hopefully, apart from the plane, makakapag-shopping tayo ng konti. So, tara. Let's go. Ito ko lang yung luggage na dinala namin. Or at least dinala ko. So, I have this Alpha Bravo Camo Tumi backpack. May CSO na nakalagay. Regalo yan ni Mrs. Sobrang gandang backpack. Tapos, ito din. Regalo din ni Mrs. Uh, Tumi CSO na parang body bag. Mga mahilig dyan sa Tumi, comment down below what is your favorite Tumi bag. Hindi ito sponsored ng Tumi. Natutuwa lang kami. So, nandito kami ngayon sa airport sa Cancun Isa lang masasabi ko, kung takot kayo sa maraming tao Takot kayo sa maraming tao, walang mask Matetest ang courage ninyo <laughs> Diba babe? <laughs> So we're back in San Francisco, San Jose. San Jose. So, puta tayo Apple Store. Pakita namin sa inyo. So, ito yung Apple Store sa... Anong mall to? Westfield? Lucky, oh. So, tingnan natin what's inside. Lucky. Ito yung iPhone section. Different iPhone cases. A charger. Nice. So, dito tayo sa Apple Watch straps. So, sa Apple Watch 45, bili tayo ng bagong strap. Sana ba yung black na ganito? Black na ganito? Sana. Yung mga metal na ganito. Yung mga maganda. Ayan o. Okay din. Ano ba? Ito ba yan? Saan ba yan dito? These are really nice. They're like the stands for multiple Apple devices. So you can put your phone and then your watch. This is really nice for movie. Nice, so. Gift card. <laughs> and for me? And strap. I think it, what was it called? It's a graphite. Graphite me Milanese loop. Yeah. So yan ang ating damage dito sa Apple Store. Yeah. Filipino pa yung nag-assist sa amin. So nakakatawa. I think one also from weird na polishing cloth. Oops. Tira mo twenty dollars. Wow. Pampunas na screen. Wow. Hahaha. Alam ko plano pumili siya. So we just came from the Apple Store. We're now headed to Louis Vuitton to check out some of the stuff that we have. Big boy. Yo. Untuck it. Para unbox, pero for shirts, nice shop, so Barbados, Indochino, Dyson, Peloton. So here at Boss, they have an NBA collaboration, nice. So, so this one is like a Golden State edition of the hoodie, and you have the Boss logo. Nice. Here at Golden Goose, so we're checking out some of the shoes that they have. Uh, this one looks really battered. <laughs> Tama New Balance vibes kanda actually. I'm asking for this one if they have it in my size. 
GGDB Pure. Nice camo design at the back. Oh, these are also nice. Ganda. White, blue sa likod. Golden goose spice. Sick. So, mission accomplished. Mayroon tayong golden goose na shoes. Hindi uh, na kami nakapag-LV kasi parang ang haba ng pila. So, we're now trying to look for a place to eat dinner. Kasi most of the restaurants dito sa building na to, mall na to, puno. So, tawid kami sa Santana Row. Sakto pa eh. Four, three. Uy, baka masagas saan tayo, babe. So, we're at some, ano ba itong restaurant? Fusion, no? Fusion ba ito, babe? Restaurant? Oh, yeah. Parang Asian Fusion. Asian Fusion. So, ito yung, ano tawag dito? Banana Leaf Salmon. Banana Leaf Salmon. Very good. It's me gulay siya. Shrimp ice steak. Medyo kakaiba. Pero by the way, natikman na namin yung salmon. Sobrang sarap niya. May sipa siya, may konting spice. May gata. May gata daw. May gata. Ano yung may gata? May gata. Sarap. Yo, so good morning everyone. Obviously, it's the next day. Masarap naman yung nakain natin. Di ba, babe? Oh, yun. Kumain kami ng sobrang panalong steak tsaka salmon. So, babalik kami doon. Streets yung pangalan yes, niya sa Santana Row. So, baka doon na lang natin kumain together with sila Kai tsaka sila Derek. <laughs> diba? End of the month. Anyway, speaking of Kai and Derek, uh, one of the brands na I was looking forward to buying is this. Ito yung Golden Goose. Nakita niyo naman yung pinuntahan natin kahapon. Kasi sobrang hinahype siya um, ni Kai and ni Derek on our Facebook chat. So, I looked into the brand, researched a bit about it. And I realized that this was actually a pair of sneakers. Well, not this particular one, but the brand that was worn by one of my favorite YouTubers, Casey Neistat, when he did, I think, sneaker shopping uh, over at Complex. So apparently, this sneaker, Kesha Mahal, is handmade in Italy. Oops. Even yung mga distressed versions nito, yun yung parang bugbug na siya tingnan, yung mga nakita nyo kahapon, those were actually distressed by hand. And that's the reason why it's pricey. Because uh, the people are making it are from Italy, handmade siya. And nakakatuwa naman talaga yung design. So this particular shoe um, is the Pure Star. So yung Pure Star is very clean white sneakers, the easiest to wear. And then ang ganda lang talaga ng may camo heel patch siya dito sa likod. Nandun yung Golden Goose. Ang ganda lang eh, nakakatuwa. So I don't know if it's comfortable. I don't know if it's going to be nice to wear. In fact, yung ibang reviews is hindi siya sobrang komportable. So gawin natin today suot ko siya. Magro-breakfast kami ni Mrs. Tapos kukwento ko sa inyo along the way if sulit pa talaga siya in terms of comfort or not. Ganda na Mrs. ko. Tignan nyo. Pakita ka naman, babe. <laughs> Ayun, susuot na namin si Golden Goose. So initial impressions. Uh, for leather sneakers na designer, they're actually pretty comfortable. Pero alam mo na magiging mas okay siya pag binugbog because the leather is kind of stiff so if you break it down a little bit more or if you wear it out parang mas okay siya teka ang daming ang daming weird things yan yung weird things oh para siyang booby trap ano ba yan mga football <laughs> para siyang oh, huwag tayo dito <laughs> change change so tawid tayo guys so pabalik kami na Santana Row doon kami magre breakfast so at kasi golden goose kasi Miss Nays naka killer boots <laughs> Kaya pala I went with the pure stars Itong white Kasi I feel that distressed They're kind of trendy But they'll eventually go out of style Kasi hirap isuot eh Unless gusto mo mukha kang gusgusin <laughs> Or yun talaga yung style mo Alam mo yun Some people really can pull it off Ako I can So ito yung breakfast ni Mrs. Ano siya? Lemony tuna sandwich? Oh, lemon, lemon herb tuna sandwich Approve ba? Approve? Favorite. <laughs> oh, laki ng baso ng ano dito yung kape. So yun. Keep putting the nameplate. Oh, okay. Yeah, just yeah. keep on doing it. Yeah. Is that Nice. Right. Love the gun metal. Thanks, man. Yeah, Appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, looks awesome. Yeah, so Ooh, sweet. So we're on our way back. Nabudol na ako. Nakita niyo naman, napabili ako ng Tumi na backpack. Babe, pakita mo nga yung Tumi backpack. <laughs> so, magkano bilhin natin? 
around 600 something dollars. So it's a little bit cheaper here for Tumi compared to the Philippines. Parang this same backpack, I think back in the Philippines would be close to, if not more than 50,000 pesos. It was there. <laughs> yeah, so value wise, since I've always wanted like a leather Tumi, boom. So at this point in the vlog, we'll head back to the hotel. Actually, this is the ending. Because the next we're to go will be in another uh, episode. We'll be heading over to actually, the actual San Francisco. Uh, we'll check out Union Square and a bunch of other stuff. So that's it for today. Peace, God bless, what's up? Peace.